think I'm back. I hope the audio works. I've returned, yeah. Can you hear any audio now? Do you hear the music? Please say you hear the music. You can hear it? Yes! Oh my gosh. Um, so it turns out all I had to do was delete my cache. And that solved it. So yay! I thought there was something wrong with my PS4 because um, before I started playing, I had to do a system update and I was like, no, what if they did something? But this is good. Yay, now you can hear it. Now you can see this whole thing all over again. Woo! Oh, okay, now, yeah. Yeah. Yes, you know. Oh. Now you can hear everyone's beautiful voices. This girl But she's not really a witness. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay, so I'm basically gonna do everything all over again. I know I don't have to talk with the horses and whatnot. Okay, Iris couldn't hold back her excitement and rushed onto the scene. Again, she shouldn't just be willy-nilly coming onto the scene. Let's zoom into the horse and examine it. Shoko's corpse was tied up here. Hmm? Wait a second. So now we have to listen to Iris talk all over again about the conspiracy theory and the Illuminati and the Freemasons. Great. That must mean there are mysteries. Okay, gotta talk with Iris. Um, let's do something else before I go into the investigation. Have you been here before? Is the game audio good? Levels good? Not too loud? Oh. Oh, この川崎地区へと至る全ての道路を警官が見張ってるわけじゃない。抜け道なら you're infected. Then why did you come here if you're so worried about the oh my god? She's worried about the chemical spill. Why did she come in? You're wasting your time. Nah, it is. Nani or Sagaster and Dakashiranaga. Son Nakoto Stemo Mudada to Mozo. Do stay this car? Konotari Taiwa, Kakan Tachiga Kumanaku Shirabema Tanda. Then Han in the Kansur Tengakariwa, Nani Mo Mitskaranakata. Mitskatara, Ivo no Tokoroni, Hokoka Kitter has Dakarana. Ivo? 
俺のパートナー、相棒のことだよ。そんな人、どこにもいないじゃないですか。シャラブ。いるんだよ、すぐ目の前に。あは、目の前に。おいしいんぱらふまいあい。ほほほほほほほほ。OK。Oh no wait, no, I have to talk to her. What are you doing? Now we have to talk. I thought stream already ended, so I missed final finale faces. It's okay. Also, hey, Regal, how you doing? Thanks for joining. Um, stream didn't end. I was just um, fixing some audio issues that uh, stream had. Uh, because um, earlier, the first time I tried to stream, the stream labs wasn't picking up my capture card audio. It was weird. I fixed it, I'm back. Also, Grace's stream was kind of long, and I spent like 16 minutes on the final battle. So maybe it's a good thing you missed it. <laughs> Uneasy. Yo, she was hard. She took a long time. She had a lot of HP. So I'm like nervous to see how she is in um in harder difficulties. How would she know all about Egyptian gods? I don't think Asian schools teach Egypt, like old ancient mythology, especially Egyptian mythology, right? Providence. Providence. あのピラミッドのてっぺんにある目のことか一ドル札の裏にも書かれてるそうですでこのプロビデンスの目はフリーメイソンやイルミナティのシンボルとも言われていてイルミナティつながったでしょどこがだよ Why do you think this is ritual murder? 私オータンから聞いたんです And I think starting here is when we left off last time. I speak of a skisa up the top. I should pay attention now. Horus, Providence, no me, Hidarime, Corete, do congat them, Gishkina, Imigo, Artosco. Mother, I speak of a skisa up the top. Eh, Steino, Hidarime. Then why did Misuki pull it out? Oh, Taka, so it get on. けど我々が現着した時には死体の左目にアイスピックはなかったただが今の話が確かだなオータと水木がやってきた時には左目にということは He would have no reason to lie unless he's part of the murder group! Why would she take the ice pick out and hide? Mizuki, why? Talk to me. We should go. No, shut up. Dame da. So mo so mo. Ipan jin o konna tokoro ni tsurete kiteru jiten de mondai nanda kara na. If you don't let me stay, I'm going to release that video. Whoa. Oh, hey, bud. Thanks for the sub. Whoa. How was your trip? The pictures look amazing. Morning sickness. Just kidding. No. No! Don't be nice to her! She's blackmailing you! It was awesome, so much good food. Ah, uh, when did you come back? Today? Yesterday? Oh, 
How is she only 105 pounds? She's freaking stick then. Oh gosh, no. Shut up. I don't like you. I don't want to like you. Blackmail is the way to anyone's heart. Ah, yeah, a creepy way to anyone's heart. Ugh. Maybe she's super short. Oh yeah, I don't know how tall she is. Eyesight. Uh, Iris, how are you feeling? What's this game about? Dating sim? Oh no, this is a murder mystery. It's a visual novel that has um some puzzle elements. But basically, I'm an investigator, and this woman died, and she was acquaintance of mine. I thought I heard something in the back, whoops. Uh, she was an acquaintance of mine, and her daughter is kind of, like, I'm looking after her. So now I'm trying to figure out who killed her and why. Dating some look at this dead body! Ooh, let's make out with it! <laughs> Aritek Soup was talking about this game. Really? So, um, yeah. Does he, she like it? Have they started playing it? I will kick you out of the car if you throw up in it. Oh, I would put it right back where it came from. <laughs> then don't throw up. Iris opened the passenger window. He, and he's a huge nerd. Kafka. Hey! Hey, are you saying that I'm a huge nerd? I think he likes it. We were talking about Fire Emblem Three Houses and he mentioned taking a break after Cloud for this one. I'm still in, I'm still in my Cloud one. Oh, I'm doing Animal Crossing, Happy Home Designer, and Fire Emblem, and this game. Now I could start up Tales of Zillia, and I'm playing Final Fantasy XIV again. There's so many games to juggle at once. Ah, so much hard work. I'm on Dimitri and just finished the five years after part. Is this your first playthrough? Oh my gosh. Your arm won't get ripped off. Uh, Black Eagles first? Ugh, Black Eagle! Ugh. Glad I started with Edelgard. Really? You're happy you started with her? She's gonna be my last playthrough and I'm kinda not looking forward to it because... Like, playing the Dimitri route, the Blue Lions route, I'm just like... BETRAYAL! She has the best story so far, honestly. <gasps> okay, I guess I'm gonna have to finish Golden Deer and then move on to Black Eagles to see. <laughs> Dimitri is not the worst! Oh my... No! He's not the worst! The worst boy. No, he's not. I ended up um, accidentally marrying him because I was choosing. I was deciding to see which boy I wanted to marry in the end, but then I didn't realize that after I unlocked everyone's A support, um, the support ranks still go up when you're like fighting with people. And so, like, all the other boys started to get their support levels up with other girls. So it's, uh, you got and then, I, like, I picked, oh, who do I want to spend time with? And I'm like, Dimitri, because he needs some company or else he's gonna go crazy. And so I ended up marrying him. <laughs> if I picked a dude, it would probably be Felix. I wanna get Mercedes. Mm. Yeah, I was thinking, maybe you wanna go with Felix, because in the beginning, I was like, wow, Felix is a huge jerk. Mm. But... After looking through all his supports and the five-year time skip, I'm like, no, Felix is actually the most level-headed. I wanted to get with him, but he married um, Dorothea because I recruited her into my house. 
That's how it is in real life. <laughs> yeah, he's a great guy. Yeah, Felix is great. In the beginning, he was spiky, and I was like, oh, I don't like you, but... He's a cool kid. You spend time with someone just because they're kind of lonely, and then you accidentally get married. Oh, yeah. Just like real life. I don't want to go into your house. I don't care about you enough. I said my goodbyes, then turned to leave. But, <coughs> but out of the corner of my eye... <gasps> Wait! I thought she was dead! Wait! I thought she was dead! In my mind palace, she was dead! Wait, was it not this lady? I felt my body freeze. Because that woman... She's... Dead! Yeah, see? She was dead in my mind palace. In my somnia. No, it can't be. It can't be. I felt like my mind and body were being torn in opposite directions. As I stood there, stunned, Iris grabbed my hand. Who the heck are you? Is any of this even real? Wait! This is the room that's inside my mind palace! What? <laughs> Dude, I could have gotten Dorothea, but I picked Edelgard. <laughs> Did you start off with male or female Byleth? Her mouth moving really in two different views. <laughs> also, not knowing what a mind palace is, I'll we'll just hear you scream it. Ah, female. Oh, I didn't know Edelgard could do female S rank. That's cool. That's interesting to know. Yeah, I was debating whether I should do Mercedes, but I was like, again, I didn't know when the parts would come up when it's like, hey! Although, thinking back on it, it's pretty obvious when you get to choose who you want to, um, marry. But I was just like, oh, let's just go see how everyone's doing. Only if you're a Black Eagle? Yeah. Because I don't think you can recruit her in any other route. And I don't think her support raises with you if you're in any other route. <laughs> She's Iris's mom, but why is she alive? If from my memory, she's dead. You shut up, it's classified information! Such a dumb girl. You can't recruit any of the heads of houses, unfortunately. Yeah, otherwise that would totally ruin the story. Gimme Cloud. I don't know who I'm gonna marry in my, um... Oh wait, I mailed Byleth for a Golden Deer route. I think... Mm -hmm. Who am I gonna marry? Hilda... I want Hilda to marry Cloud. I want Marianne to marry marry Ferdinand. Lysithia with Felix. Um Leone with Raphael. Um Purple haired dude Lawrence and Ignatz. I think I want to leave them alone. They can they can buddy up together. Who did I want to marry? I'm male Byleth. Who's another girl that's left? Leone, Marianne, Lysithia. Oh, I'm going for Shamir. Yeah. Just because someone is dead in your head, that doesn't mean they are dead in real life. But that Somnia, it's my memories, isn't it? After an awkward silence, Iris bought us some tea on a tray. She put everything down on the table and sat down on the sofa. Sofa! Iris and her mother Hitomi are sitting on the sofa. A coffee table. There are some elementary workbooks on the table. But looking closely, one in the middle is different. Osagami Sumo Wrestler Directory. Osagami Sumo? Uh, I 
the tea. Steam is rising from the tea. It's poisoned. <laughs> Iris is gonna kill me. <laughs> there are irises! There were irises in my mind palace too. Ooh. And Ayame? and Aiba snorted them up. あれは神崎あやめって言うんです。英語で言うとウィンターアイリス。その名の通り寒い時期に咲くあやめで。ちょうど今朝、咲いたばかりなんですよ。あやめの花言葉は良き知らせと希望。Good news and hope. 今朝起きてあの花を見たとき、何かいいことが起こるような気がして。What the heck? What was with that awkward silence? A winter iris. It means good news and hope. Good news! You saw a dead body! <laughs> I've seen that cushion somewhere before. No, not just a cushion. I saw this entire room in my dream last night. どうしたんだ? <laughs> Window. You can see the trees and sky outside. That's what it looks like. Plant! Plant, 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 plant! Please let me just click on the plant. There we go. I can see a plant in the corner. No insects, unfortunately. Sorry, Iba. Does Iba eat insects? Plants. Shells. A wooden shelf. A speaker system. Two speakers and a console. Two speakers and a long thin box in the middle. What? Why did you have to know? Huh, it's like... Like what? You know. What is it like? It's a Yeah, what about it? It's a great compost. What? What? So, so I wish mine were the what? I anyone who missed the first dream is gonna think you are insane. <laughs> Maybe I am. A speaker system. Two speakers with one I don't understand what he's trying to say. Whatever, we move on. I got a trophy from that, so cool. Um, I guess I can't interact with this. Shoebox. It's a shoebox. I wonder what they smell like. <laughs> Why would you wonder what a shoebox smells like? It's a shoebox. I'm a pervert. Mysterious object. There's a calendar and a strange object on the shelf. It reminds me of a kind of angel. What is that object? Mm. Bookshelf. Bookshelf. There are no books on it, but it's definitely a bookshelf. I saw it in a catalog before, so I know. There's another mysterious thing. A bookshelf. Standing lamp. The lights are off. Wait, in my Somnia, that lamp was a rose shape. I can't interact with that basket right now. Something? No. Cupboard. There are a lot of dishes. Oops. I need to do that again. Dining table. A dining table! Yes. What? That was a dying message! <laughs> That's a dying message! Uh, microwave. A microwave! Yo, I was gonna pop in there. <laughs> Put your heart in there first. Refrigerator! How do you put a giraffe in the refrigerator? You open it, you put the giraffe in, you close it. Mm -hmm. 
How do you put elephant in the refrigerator? You open the refrigerator door, take the giraffe out, put the elephant in, close the door. Why are they saying this joke? Where did I hear those riddles from before? It's like, hey, first graders can get this, but adults can't. I can't see them from here, but there's probably a sink and stove on the other side of the kitchen counter. Mm, door. There's a door in the back of the room. Picture. Why are they covered in brown? There's a drawing on the wall. I wonder if Iris drew this when she was younger. Uh, phone. A telephone in the corner. Mm. What if I examine the entrance? It's the front door. Can I examine this picture? Clock. A clock! This picture? No. Okay, so now I think I should talk with people. Hitomi. Um, where do you work? Local elementary school teacher. いえ、そんなことは元々子供が好きなので苦労も喜びのうちの一つです。May uh, I ask how old you are? 37です。37。Got right now is 30. イリスさんは確か18歳でしたね。そうですよ。So she had her when she was 19? ということはかなり若くして。19歳の時にイリスを見ました。ご主人は結婚はしていないんです。未婚の母というわけですか。え。アバウトレンジュオキュラ。そういえばレムニスケートの社長、オキュラレンジュと知り合いだそうですね。Think she's insane or no? おきゅらくんは高校の時の同級生で、彼これ20年以上の付き合いになります。Oh、responding uh, do you know Renju's ex-wife? もちろん知っていますが。You know she's dead? でも直接会ったのは2回だけです。最初はおきうらくんの結婚式の時で、2度目は1月ほど前に… Community Saturday? Oh, community is this Saturday? Um, let's see, am I doing this anything this Saturday? I don't think I am. So yeah, we can meet up for it. And we can trade stuff! Can't ask JT. Insane people don't know they are insane. Isn't that scary? That's a scary thought. Because they think everything they think is normal. Um, anything else? I saw her. I saw her in my dream last night. No, that's impossible. Okay, well, let's talk to Iris. Um, how long have you been living here? What the heck, I want to meet her for church too. Church? Huh? We're, we're talking about Pokemon Go. もちろん、ママはそれよりもずっと前から。私も小さい頃からこの家で育ちました。思い出がいっぱい詰まってる家なんです。<laughs> 
一時期引っ越しを考えたこともあるんですがどうしてもここを離れたくなくて。No, just keep living in the house you have, you save a lot more money, especially if it's all paid off. それはちょっといろいろと。Because you died in here? Um, you look chipper. So, this <laughs> car? Huh. Kesa no yoka, a tatta na to mote. A hunch? Yoka? Watashi no shiro, hanaga saiteru de shaw? Saiteru ga, sore ga? I was gonna hear good news today. Um, about the flowers. Iris was hinting about the flowers blooming behind her. Yeah, I saw the flowers. Okay, you were saying? Shh, I'm not community day is Pumpkin Wingo. Mm -hmm. I see a bunch of heathens here. Because you go to church on Sundays. I am certainly Jelly's a good kid. You're a good kid too, Webb! We're all good kids. Oh, oh. So, Oh no, I hope that's not the end of it. I still need to talk to them. Moshkoste, Hidari Kiki Deska. Ah, it. Mama. And then she got stabbed on the right side and she's paralyzed. So, maybe she didn't die in that incident in my dream. But it happened. Iris, you seem to be doing well now. はい。おかげさまで。今ならライオンになって勝てそうです。ガオ。ガオ。だ、ダズナットインプレスオレマイテイトオリアクションすればいいんだ。ユーロックアットハーベリーストレンジリー。ドンティンクアバウトイットヘ
I don't know if everything that happened in my dream is a dream or... I think they recognize me. I think... I'm so confused, actually. Eyesight. Myself. Um, play a game? Allow me to introduce myself. <laughs> Why am I doing this now? Or is she really not how she is? I think she knows something about my situation from six years ago. She's just not saying anything. And her mom, I thought, was dead, but turns out she's still alive and her right side's, like, not good. Still don't know a lot about Iris. Um, I'm gonna pay, be paying him 400k yen and he has three fifth star financial savvy. Dude! <laughs> I want a super smart chicken that's good with finances. Uh, focus, you can play a game. Chiritori! Oh, easy. I suppose. Chiritori no. Li. 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 Uh, focus, you got this. Oh my god. This guy is so silly. Oh, he looks so scared. 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 About Shoko's corpse. Shoko's corpse is in the middle of the night. On Friday, at 5 o'clock.死因は区間全面部を複数の箇所にわたって刺されたことによる失血死。狂気はどうやら水木が持っていたアイスピックと考えて間違いなさそうだ。現場には指紋や毛髪を含めて犯人の手がかりになりそうな遺留品は一切残
Then take the time to decipher it. About the blood stains. ショウコを乗せた馬に結婚は見当たらなかった。つまり、あそこが殺害現場ではないと。ショウコはどこか別の場所で殺されて、あのメリーゴーランドへと運ばれてきた。だとすると、水木が犯人というのはありえない。水木
I think I'll do Raido Kuzunoha first because Persona 4, I already played it before. And a bunch of other people have played it. But um, Raido Kuzunoha, I feel like not a lot of people have seen it before. So I'll play Raido Kuzunoha after I finish AI Somnium Files. I want a scary game for October, that's all I have to say about that. I played scary game in summer. Because <laughs> I was like, oh, let's switch it up. Instead of doing something spooky for October, let's do it in the summer. Or like Asian ghost stories. Faster just wait for streaming. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Find a fellow papers. It looks like the manual for the sync machine. Monitor. On. Strange strings of characters and figures scroll across the monitor. Pewter. Uh, about Iba. Ooh, scary October. <laughs> uh, I'm all scared out for right now. Maybe next year I'll do Fatal Frame 2. Who knows? We'll see. If a Fatal Frame game comes for Switch also, maybe I'll do that one day. I will self-destruct in your eye socket. <laughs> I was always listening. How's Misuki doing? Do PT? I don't have PT and you can't download PT anymore. This game going to take forever before I get to see Raido again. No, it's not going to take forever. I hope. <laughs> but once I start Raido, then it, when I finish the first game, I'm going to immediately move on to the second game. So it's like back to back Raido. Uh, anything else I can talk with him about? That's Pewter. His real name is Amanoma, but he goes by Pewter here. 36 years old. He's a member of Abyss, like me. Abyss? Well, why did I say Abyss? Uh, he's a genius engineer that designed the sync system and other machines. He also invented Aiba. He's her caretaker in a way. Uh, boss. Um, did you get Renju's permission? Mizuki no Try White Day, it's a Korean horror game with pretty waifus. Ooh, I've heard of White Day. Wait, didn't you play White Day? And I remember seeing one video clip, and I was like, ah, creepy. What system is White Day for? Is it just on Steam? Yeah, you did play it. Uh oh, Renju, are you doing shady stuff? Oh, shoot, she was still talking. Uh, are you sure you want to do this? I'm not sure you want to do this. I'm not sure you want to do this. I'm not sure you want to do Her injuries are mental. I love that it's PC that they made for consoles. Oh, I didn't know they made it for consoles too. Oh, so she has a psychic shield. Is it like same kind of scary that Fail Frame was where like ghosts pop up and you have to take pictures of them? <laughs> Any progress on the investigation? この<laughs> It's very short, so it's a good choice if you're uh, planning on playing something in October. Hmm. Play Spooky's House of Jump Scares. No, no jump scares. <laughs>、<laughs>、<laughs> um. There's nothing on the monitor. Why is that one off, huh? Boss is watching Mizuki through the glass. Chair. 
Chair, chair, chair. Just a chair. Mm, needs to be. I'll try talking to her. She can't hear me from here. Great! Misuki is lying in the sink machine on the other side of the glass. Sink machine. There's an enormous machine beyond the window. This machine is known as a sink machine. Mm. Just want to see if there's anything else I can examine um, to unlock trophies like I did with the speakers. I don't know what he was trying to get at with the speakers. Peter, are you ready? Get ready to begin! No jump scare only. <gasps> the game itself is actually not scary at all. Ah! Maybe I'll play it. I'll look up info about it. And then I'll decide. Sounds like a terrible game. You don't like jump scares? Ooh, I don't like jump scares. Hold her hands. Jump scares are cheap. True. Like Fatal Frame, it was a gradual. Like in the beginning, it was super scary, but then there's still like elements in the environment that still scare you. That's not necessarily a jump scare, but it's like, oh, the lid of that box moved. Or like, oh, hey, there's this sound, or like there's a woman in shadow in that window. It's just like, ah! Um, so here's what's going to happen. I'll find out who killed your mama. About Abyss. Abyss. Mizuki, you didn't talk to me, but I'm not a normal police officer. I'm a special police officer, Abyss, in the place of the police officer. The official name is Advanced Brain Investigation Squad. The stories and character were good. Some find it scary, but it wasn't for me. Hmm. Well, seeing as how much I yelled in Fatal Frame, it's probably going to be super scary for me. <laughs> Can I just get that one? うそつきだったり何も話してくれなかったりと。頭を打って記憶喪失になっちまうやつもいれば心に深い傷を負って。Oh, oh, Basically, I'm gonna be super invasive inside your head to find answers that I want. About the sink gear. Can you know there's no side effects? Uh, sink. With their true selves, ooh, persona. I art thou, thou art I. Uh, because I love horror game, I'm sure it'll be scary for you. You're even scared of anime horror. <laughs> Vesperia ghost ship. That ghost ship was scary, okay? I couldn't see the enemies. The atmosphere was scary. Anime horror isn't even scary. It's still scary. <laughs> when this is all over. 
Let's go to an amusement park. <laughs> huh? Let's get some of that stew you like. Let's get some sushi. Let's go get some ramen. Let's go get some unagi. Let's go get some stew you like, because at least she likes it. ほら、前に言った時、ゲロみたいだって言いながら、ゲラゲラと笑ってただろ。だけど、味は最高だって。What did you forget to tell me? A new feature. A new feature. A new feature. I don't know if they're dry or if I'm tired or both. It just feels like something's in there constantly. Six minutes. Ah! I hope this is not six actual minutes because it takes time to read stuff. That was a girl. I thought it was a dude. The character in red. Oh, my boss? Nope. She, it's a girl. Going inside her mind palace. I didn't see the ponytail. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Also, didn't see her big boobs. <laughs> okay, can't dilly dally. Just look for things that are super important. Hmm. <laughs> You'd have to do it naked. Oh, they're trying to think of um, Ghost in the Shell. <laughs> Why is there a cage around the merry-go-round? And lightning. Oh, because it was storming when she found her mom. So we gotta reach her. Oh,だ。Time so then I don't. Oh, only when standing still. Okay. I'm moving incredibly slowly, so it doesn't stop. Time.ダイレーション。中国の古事だな。do we really have to learn this now, or like, can we just start investigating, please? Tonikaku, 
So let's start exploring, dude. Stop talking. I don't. That's one thing I don't like in games when they're like, "Okay, we gotta do this. We're on a time limit, but let's talk about all this stuff." Oh, this is a cool thing, and then we could just do blah 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 blah. Okay, so there's no time to waste. We gotta do this, and I'm just like, then why just spend all that time talking about other things that you could have talked about in another time when things weren't. Okay, that's mental lock two. Mental lock three. Okay. Heal Mizuki's heart. Mizuki is mute. By healing her mental wounds, you may be able to get important info. Whoa, that mega round is spinning super fast. Whoa, the horses are moving. Throw the ice pick. Ivo, Mukono speaker got shindo stirzo. Why are the ice pick and the speaker moving? Narodo, Gono I speak to Rendo Stirinoka. So music probably heard something from the speakers. Sate. Ooh, this is creepy. Yes, so let me start investigating. Stop saying the same things over and over. There's a six to the minute time limit insomnia. Time is expended whenever Aiba is moving or performing an action. Pay attention to the remaining time left in the upper right of the screen. Unlock all mental locks within the 360 second time limit. Um, pull out takes 20 seconds. Uh, let's examine some other stuff. Oh, wait, I forgot. I have to. I'm gonna pull it out. Pull out! Right? No one wants to see their mother like this. That's what she said. <laughs> Oh, it made the speaker taller! That's a long ice pick. The, um, control... house. Control booth. Okay, so that's mental lock one. There's two paths for mental lock two. Redirected the lightning with the lightning rod. Okay. We probably have to do something in the control booth. That's what she said. <laughs> That's collected. How you doing? Thanks for joining. Date, timey got any height You've got a timey? What's a timey? Timey? Time induction mata in encephalon. What? Why couldn't you say all this when we were starting this? Mm -hmm. Why are you sitting? あ。まるで夢のようだな。というか実際に夢だからな。夢の世界だからこそ、そんな不思議なことができてしまうのだ。Stop! Stop saying unnecessary dialogue. Just be like, this function is this, this function is this. Now go! Timings are items that affect time. You will sometimes obtain them when you perform an action. Timings can only affect the time taken to perform an action. You are only able to hold three timings. Picking up a timey when you already hold three will replace one. Timings are expended after one use, but use them as often as you can. Okay. I got a timey. Um, control Ma microphone. Mic no Yoda. Threaten, shout, shout. Yamero, Yamero, that's no immediate.
that seemed to do something? Um, wait. Why does she look so happy? Who knows? Maybe she's happy to be walking around inside someone's head. Maybe she's happy she got to yell. I want to look at the panda pieces. Why are they in pieces? Uh, put back together, duh. Oh my gosh, Aiba. Your overconfidence is your weakness. Your faith in your friends is yours. Wait, that. What if I kick it away? Oh! So. Do I kick it again? No. Um, that's it for Panda. What if I go into the control room now? Uh, open? Why would I knock? いろいろと制御できるかもしれない。そんなにうまくいくとは思えないが。では、なさそうだな。出口も Remove the bird cage, blow the bird cage away. The left one. A bird cage, but what is inside there? Oh, it's a picture of uh, Misuki inside the carousel, I think. Um, lift it? Peek inside. I know what's inside. Tackle, lift it. Time will not be used. Proceed. Yes? Oh, I should have used the tiny! Oh, duh. Okay, remove the cage. Was this the right one to pick? Because maybe retry will allow you to return to a save point just after unlocking a mental lock. But you only have three retries. Going back one lock costs one. Going back two costs two. Going back three locks will cost all three. You regain your three retries by selecting restart from the menu or by failing the sink. This is likely your best option if time is low. Are they saying that I did something wrong? <laughs> Um, piece together. Oh, wait, uh. Yes. Time to 50. No. Make time one fifth. Make time a half. I'll make it time a half and piece together. Why would I make time 50 if it takes less time to actually do the thing? Mizuki was happy here. She came here with her parents. Well, the birdcage is gone, but now have I stopped the merry-go-round from going crazy? So the photo was the key. I remember it clearly. One day I came home to find that photo torn up in the trash can. When I asked Mizuki about it, she started to cry. 
I don't know why she tore up that photo. But whatever her reason, it seems like she regrets it. Since we repaired the photo in Somnium, the birdcage... But how the heck are we slowing down the freaking... Maybe it has something to do with the horses that are upside down. Don't Okay, the panda's all fixed now. Selecting a map icon will bring up a map of the current Somnium world. You can see your current location and objects you've investigated on your Somnium map. If you're lost or want to save time, try checking the map. You do want to check the map. Shut up! Microphone, gates, panda ride parasol. Probably something to do with the parasol. How do I get to it? Is the parasol over? Th Where's the parasol? Parasol, toko. Panda ride. Okay, if panda ride was there, okay, then parasol's on the other side. Hey, stop moving. Uh, let's see. One fifth, a half, a fourth. Let's do a fifth because that's gonna run out soon. Um, spin more, stop. Obviously, stop. Cool. Duh. Okay, so now I know how to use the timey things. It makes more sense. There she is. Ah, yes. uh, affirmative. Three six, three sixty second limit. If you choose the correct answer as your final action, you can actually exceed the three sixty second time limit. Even if it seems like you don't have a lot of time left, don't give up. You might be able to do it. Computer sleep talking. Hmm. More than one second. When you clear, you get a. Prize? No boss! Anything but that! Ugh. So if I ex if I have extra time left over, then I get a prize. Oh wait, there's hidden objects throughout the Somnium. And then that lets me um unlock images. I won't do that now though. Wait, Merry Go Round Horse. Merry Go Round Horse. Talk? Spank? <laughs> I can spank the horse! Um... I'll talk to it. Nope. Can't talk to a horse! Horses can't talk. <laughs> <laughs> His face. Ooh, they did not like that. Hug her, make her laugh, smile at her. Ooh, ooh, ooh. No. Um. Let's do this. You're safe. It's okay, I'm here for you! Footprints! But where do they go? Whose footprints are they? It's a dude with a hole in his head. And this torso. Did it do the right path? Hugs, Mizuki! Awaken! That took 50 seconds to hug her? 
pain, mother, blood, and I don't want to see the rest of that trophy title. That's creepy. Day two, Saturday. Make I. Why is it May Kai now? Because earlier it was Sai Guy or something. I feel like these chapter titles would make more sense if I understood the kanji, what they meant. <gasps> Her eyes are normal again. Boss, don't don't question her now. She just got better. After she had calmed down, I asked her a few questions. I asked about her I asked her about last night, about the Nile message, about Ota, and about Shoko. I know that after Ota ran off, something must have happened to make Mizuki want to hide. Can I talk to anyone else? Peter. Um, about that figure I saw. Ah, that's it. I've been monitoring here. I think... I think... What if it's me? What if that is the one who's just like, I killed it, but I have no memory? <laughs> no, but then Aiba would know because Aiba's connected to the internet and all that jazz. Okay, so she's not like the Somnium-Sekai. たくさんの奇妙な現象を経験しましたよね。当然ながらあれは現実に起こった出来事ではありません。夢は様々な記憶が複雑に絡み合って構築されるもの。それを紐解いて手がかりを見つけ出していくのが進化の仕事です。Why does it take you so long to answer me? Aibo is a link with the brain of the Dateh-san. In other words, Aibo is a part of the Dateh-san. For this reason, the Dateh-san's genetic data is connected to the Dateh-san. I hate this video that they're playing. Oh my gosh, why do you have to make it, like, loop after a fade in, fade out? Aibo's main program is a part of the Dateh-san's brain of the Dateh-san. But it's weird that it's Aiba exploring the Sunbeam world and not me. Because I'm the one going into the person's brain. Aiba <laughs> heard that. Does the game have an English dub? It does. Uh, about Somnium. Would this be better in English dub? Because I don't read out all the lines and that way people can hear it easily. Yes. <laughs> That way, I don't have to read out all the lines in English. So English. Let's see if it changed. 
Who do you think the suspect is? Pewter, who do you think the culprit is? Well, let's see. Perhaps it was you, Special Agent Dati. What? Dutty. <laughs> I'm kidding. But are you about Iva's appearance? Hey, Pewter, when we were in Somnium earlier, Iva was in human form. She's never looked like that before. That was Iva's idea. What? I thought you would be more pleased. I designed it to your taste. Well, part of that was my taste. I know everything inside your mind. You don't have to hide it. Pewter, Iva's broken. She's talking crazy. I am not broken. Perhaps Iba admires the human form. It's not that. It was just a little something. I like your see-through hands. Kaname Date to be my host. I owe him gratitude. Kaname Date. I simply thought that appearance would make him happy. Why would that make me happy? English dub isn't too bad. I always get curious about English dub. I actually have no idea what's going on because I'm playing Yakuza and not watching stream. That laugh mouth. Yeah, the laugh mouth is kind of creepy. Different strings of characters and numbers continue to scroll on the monitor. Oops. Uh, machine. Ink machine. You can see the sink machine through the window. Can I talk to Pewter again? Pewter is standing with his hands in his pockets. Okay, uh, let's talk to Boss. Um, about Mizuki's muteness. Yeah, I'm glad she's talking again. You healed the wounds in her heart. They sound good. Yeah, the dub isn't that bad. Well, you meaning you and Iva. You don't have to, but it would be nice to have a quick recap. Reception. We'll do I after they're all done talking. The for helping Mizuki recover her voice. Mizuki. All did was follow my instructions. Date, Mizuki needs you. Protect her. Mizuki. Okay, so quick recap again. Um, the game started off with me investigating a murder at this abandoned theme park. Uh, the victim was a woman who was tied up and killed with an ice pick and her left eye gouged out. Uh, we found her daughter sitting in the column of the uh, merry-go-rounds column where that woman was tied to. Her daughter was mute though, and so we can't couldn't really ask her any questions. And then the next day, my main character started to investigate around to look for more clues as to who the real killer could be. We ran into this stupid kid named Ota, who is a total fanboy of this one um, e-girl. Can I call her e-girl? She's basically like a streamer YouTuber uh, named Iris. And Iris is like, hey, let me go with you to investigate. And she recorded a video blackmailing me saying, hey, if you don't let me do this, I'm going to release this video and it's going to look bad for you. So I brought her with her. I brought her with me to the amusement park. And she started saying like, oh, what if it's a ritual cult killing? Blah, blah, blah. And then I brought her back home, and it turns out her home is a room that I saw in my dream when I was examining my Dates on um, Somnia. And I thought her mother was stabbed and killed, but her mother's still alive. But the side that she was stabbed on, her right side, her arm doesn't like work well anymore. So I've got to figure out what the heck happened to me six years ago that I was in Iris's house and I saw her mom covered in blood on the floor. And then we, and now we just synced into Mizuki's brain. And I haven't questioned her yet, but we'll see what she knows about the investigation. I spanked the horse. <laughs> I tried to talk to the horse. I really wanted to try spanking it. And then we spanked the horse. Uh, let's see, thoughts on the suspect. How would I know? We still don't have enough information. I just want to see if you have any thoughts, investigation, dude. Special agent. About what I saw in Somnium. 
No need to report specifics. I saw everything. We saw it all from here on the control room. What the sinker sees in Somnium is projected here, remember? We've got it all recorded. <laughs> Isn't it incredible? I invented it. Good job, Peter. Anyway, we know about the figure you saw. I wonder who that could be. That's what I was asking you about thoughts on the suspect, lady. Do you have any questions? Right, there was something. Hey, Mizuki, when we found you, you were holding the ice pick, right? Can you tell us why? When I got there, the ice pick was... It was... It was stuck in my mom's eye. I couldn't think straight. I... The only thing I could think was... I had to get it out. So, you panicked and pulled it out? Yeah. And you held on to it when you hid in the column? Yeah. Okay, I think that's everything I could ask the boss. Do you have any questions? Okay, just one more question. Nope, she has one this more question. This is very important. When you pulled out the ice pick, was Shoko's eye still there? I'm pretty sure it wasn't. This kid is up. The eye socket was Yeah. Empty. She saw her mom yeah. dead. Thank with you, the Mizuki. Ice pick that in her was eye. Very helpful. Wait, I missed that. <laughs> Pretty sure it wasn't. The ice socket was empty. Yes. Gross. Law shines in moments like this. This is some trauma. She yeah, this is terrible. Anymore. Now we know that Mizuki did not remove the victim's eye. When we got to the scene, it was definitely missing. And it has not yet been recovered. We can therefore conclude it has been removed from the scene. Okay, now I talk to Mizuki. Um, how are you doing? I told you I'm fine. So annoying. <gasps> Mizuki, I'm just watching out already, for you. Huh? The pressure is annoying. What pressure? Under Force pressure. Area measured in Pascal's dummy. Pushing down on me. Pushing down I on see you. she is back to her usual self. Her attitude is within normal parameters. I think I liked her better when she was silent. Ha! Uh, hello, where's my cursor? Oh, there it is. Um, are you hungry? I'm fine now. But I didn't forget your promise. A promise? We're gonna eat that nasty stew. Stew? You said you'd take me. So you heard that, huh? Aphonia only affects speech. Her hearing should still be intact. Sure, Mizuki. When we're all done here. Uh... About that figure I saw. Say, Mizuki. Who was that figure I saw? What? Insomnia, in your dream. I saw a silhouette. Date, Mizuki would not understand the question. She does not experience Somnium as you do. You are witnessing a dream inside her brain. Um, about the figure I saw. Never mind. Did you see anyone at the merry-go-round the night you found Shoko? I did. I saw someone in the corner past the merry-go-round. Who did you see? I don't know. It was dark and raining. They looked scary, so I hid inside the merry-go-round. That's why she the hid. The door was open a little bit, so I snuck in. Um, who sent you the Niall message? I... I can't tell you. You gotta why tell not? me. Because I don't want to. That's Mizuki. not a reason. You gotta cooperate with the you investigation. You were at the scene of the crime because of that Nile message. You Whoever found your sent dead mom. You is a prime suspect. That's more reason I'm not gonna tell she's you. Going to answer. When she is in a mood, it's impossible to get her to talk. That's the kind of girl she is. <sighs> Sometimes I think you know her better than I do. How long do you think I've been observing her? It's been four years now. Correct. It's been I ten years. 
like. Actually, never mind. Some things I'm better off not knowing. By the way, we already looked into Mizuki's cell phone. The line message was in the immediate. Unfortunately, the contents were wiped. Great. I'm tracing the sender of the Nile message through other means. I keep saying line because that's time. the program I use, but it's Nile. Summarize for me. Anyway, I get the story. Mizuki witnessed a suspicious person at the scene, but she didn't get a good look at them. Maybe there's something at the scene we missed. Date, could you return to the scene of the crime? Sure there can do, ma'am. Park than we first thought. Mizuki is lying in the chair. Lying in the chair? No, she's sitting in a chair. She seems to be doing okay, but she's got that gloomy look in her eyes. I sympathize with her. Last night she saw her mother. Well, she saw what no kid should ever have to see. It will take a while for her to get back to normal. Hey, can I pop this cherry? Oh my. Dante, you sounded quite proud of that. <sighs> Perhaps you'd like to repeat it. <laughs> Perhaps you'd like to repeat it. Just, it's not the same as the first time. Oh my gosh. Lying as in she's fibbing. Uh, <laughs> what the F? That is she's underage. Yeah, that was creepy. A chair. Can I talk to Mizuki again? Okay, map. Bloom Parko! Bum, bum, bum. Saturday, 8.13. When I returned to the scene, I brought Mizuki with me. I saw a suspicious figure in Somnium, but I couldn't be sure of its exact location. I brought Mizuki along to help pin it down. Somewhere around here, right? Yep. Oops, I forgot it's Otto! It's Otto! Oh, that was it. Um, A bench! <laughs> I will keep examining the stings over and over. Skewered horse! Here's the horse turned upside down. It looks like a sad, overturned insect. Uh, give me the barrier! Cityscape! Kawasaki District buildings in the distance. Give me the barrier! Ooh, Ferris wheel! The Ferris wheel! The eye that doesn't blink. Creepy. Give me barrier! <gasps> They're not giving me the barrier! Ooh, sky. In Tokyo, even the nighttime is bright. Even in the patches of sky, I can't see the stars. That's true. Oh, a UFO! No, wait, that's a plane. <gasps> oh, UFO! No, wait, that's a drone! <laughs> oh, a UFO! No, wait, just a grandma. What? That grandma's boogie it through the night sky. I must be really, really tired. There are no stars tonight. That's it for the sky. Wow, that was funny. Mizuki, um, are you cold? What do you care? You <gasps> never cared about me ever. Oh. I liked it that way. Oh. I don't want you getting close to me. You think I like you now because I hugged you after the sink? Did you think, aw, how sweet she likes me? Don't get it twisted. I only hugged you because you were standing right in front of me. Could have been anything. Could have been a pole or cactus. In fact, I wish it were a cactus. So stop worrying about me, okay? So she says. I think she's only acting prickly towards me because she doesn't want to grow close to another person and then have them separate or and leave her like her parents did when they got divorced. It's okay, Mizuki. I understand. I'll, I'm still here for you. Uh, was it because of Pop and Cherry comment? I think it was because of the Pop and Cherry comment, though. <laughs> I mean, her mom was horribly murdered. Yeah, I think that's why she's just like, don't come near me, I don't want to lose anyone else. Um, do you remember anything? Yeah, I do. What do you remember? I went to this amusement park when I was little. I was four. I remember it so clearly. This is where I saw my mom and dad smile. I had so many happy memories here. The only happy memories I really have are from here. 
memories of my family are so bright and colorful. But now, this is where mom... Mm. Um, what's wrong? Nothing. Just wondering where this goes. Mizuki is looking into the bush. Or maybe behind it? No! There was one more dialogue option! No! No! Damn it. I missed it. I missed the dialogue option. Ugh. Don't come near me. Oh my gosh. Not anymore. Ah! Damn it. Maybe I have to look past the bush. Uh, what's past here? And then I can talk to her again. This leads to the subway. Subway? Subway? It has, of course, closed down. It is no longer in service. Guess we're gonna examine the subway. This is due to the explosion at the chemical plant that occurred years ago. The surrounding district of Kawasaki was contaminated and declared off limits. Bloom yes, Park we already know that. Reason. We already know that. As Don't rehash the same information. This means that railroads and public transportation to and from this area were shut down as well. You gonna talk to me? Nope, can't talk to her. The subway. Iba, does the entire track run underground? No. This stream took a the turn for the worse. The from Bloom Park eventually rises to ground level. At a railroad crossing? Correct. Then the tracks must cross the surface street at some point. Correct. Can we get any CCTV footage from there? A railroad crossing. Railroad crossing? Iba, do me a favor. Can you see if any cars were driving on that surface street last night? Searching. Hey, you've been quiet for a long time. Are you okay? Just you won't talk to me! I've got something. I picked up a single vehicle traversing that street last night. A black SUV. I ran the plate through the vehicle registration database to find the owner. It's it stolen. Shoko Nadami's ex-husband and Mizuki's father. Renju Okiura. Oh my god. No, some- I think- Are they trying to frame him? So let me get this straight. You think that daddy drove his car on the tracks through the tunnel, stopped at the closed down station and carried mom's body to the park? I can't prove it was Renju. There's a chance someone else was driving the car. Yeah. Yeah. But in any case, I know that the suspect must have used subway tracks. That explains why there were no cars parked near the scene. Using that subway station, we could take the body right to the merry-go-round without being caught on camera. Daddy didn't do it! Oh, when you say it I like that... Say Either Oof. way, I have to talk to Renju. Yeah, you and like, Renju went in for questioning it early in the afternoon, and then we haven't been able to contact him since. This is not... No bueno. A steering wheel. Whoops, I forgot. I have to talk to Mizuki. Um... Uh, about the suspicious figure. Hey, Mizuki, tell me again. The person you saw at the merry-go-round. No, it wasn't Daddy. I know it wasn't. You're sure? Well, I... I don't know. I don't know. Uh, about the Nile message. Mizuki, Renju sent you that Nile message, didn't he? Or at yes. least it came from his phone. I got this buddy of mine. Real bad personality, but real good with technology. Got some help from them. Bad personality. There was a message sent at 805 last night. Does it sound familiar? Mizuki, Daddy got caught up in something serious. Please come to Bloom Park's merry-go-round right away. Daddy needs your help. Please do as I say. He did send the text message. Yeah, that was it. It was from Daddy's phone. But I didn't want to say anything because that would make Daddy a suspect, so. So you kept quiet? Yeah. 
My dad's never said anything like that to me, ever. That he was counting on me? I had to go. It's, this is too easy. It can't be the dad. I think he's gonna be dead? Yeah, I think the dad's gonna be dead too. I think that's why we can't get in contact with him. Cause they're gonna be like, oh, they, they managed to track us down to, um, Renju because of his car. But after his car, let's kill all the leads. That's the Nile message. But it couldn't be him. Why not? Daddy couldn't have sent the message. Someone else must have used his phone. And his car. Daddy wasn't driving the car either. Somebody else did it. The killer did it, not Daddy. The only evidence we have so far leads to one conclusion. The cell phone and the car were both operated by Renju Okiura. Okiura. You look like you want to say something. I don't want to say anything. I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to talk to anyone who thinks my daddy is a killer. Look, I don't want to believe it either. I've known him for more than five years now. He's like family to me. I'd never want to put cuffs on him. I would never want Mizuki to see that. Anyway, Renju just isn't the kind of guy who would commit a crime like this. When was the last time you saw your dad? I think about a week ago. When I went to hang out at Lemon Escape. Did you notice anything different about him? Nothing really. He was the same as usual. And he didn't come to see you in the hospital, did he? No. Not even for his own daughter. That is very unusual. Mm, when was the last time you spoke with your dad? I don't remember. It was a while ago. What about you? What about me? You tried calling him. I did. I called earlier, and I tried a few times last night. And he didn't pick up? No. Ba -ba. More mysteries! Phone! Date. Incoming call from the boss. Connected. Hey, I just got the report from Ima. Renju is a suspect? He's definitely suspicious. I agree. I think he's our number one suspect. He's been acting strange since last night. He didn't come see Mizuki in the hospital, won't pick up his phone, and he vanishes after questioning. He doesn't have an alibi. I think her, I either. think Renju was being doesn't. blackmailed by someone else. No, not one we can corroborate. <sighs> but what could that person want? Oh wait, I need to talk to boss. Um, about Renju's questioning. He didn't give us any new information. He didn't have much to say at all, really. Mm, about Renju's alibi. Shoko's time of death was estimated to be about 5 p.m. yesterday. Renju claims that he was at home alone at the time. Not a strong alibi. No one can back up his story. Uh, any idea where Renju is? No, I told you he vanished. Where are you headed? Renju's house. Don't bother. I had local cops search the place. They didn't find anything. <sighs> where could well, he be? I'm not just a local cop. I could find other things. Why did you release him? So Renju was questioned at a local station? That's right. Then why didn't you keep him there? Protocol. Nothing we could do. He wasn't a suspect then, and we had nothing to charge him with. We couldn't hold him. Too true. Oh, no, 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 no. I can see boss through my left eye. Aiba is streaming the image in real time. I don't have a cell phone, never cared for them. But Aiba can connect to any network in range. That's how I'm able to communicate with HQ. To Mizuki, I look like I'm talking to a Bluetooth. She doesn't see what I see. Um, well, what am I supposed to do now? Mm, I can hang up the phone. Yeah, I have to hang up the phone. All right, boss. Let me know if you find something. You too. Keep me in the loop. Where the hell did Renju go? Is he not in his company? Uh, Sunpoke? Sunpoke? What? Um, Sunpoke. Or something. Oh, Sunfish Pocket. 
Renji was telling me about that place. It's a maid cafe that he runs. Maid cafe! I found it. Approximately 6.2 miles north northeast. In Akihabara. Akiba! Let's go buy all the figures! I really want to go back to Japan and go back to Ikebukuro! Ooh. Wait, it's nighttime and the doors are just open? Can't be. <gasps> He's dead! <gasps> oh my gosh! I didn't think it would be this gnarly. Whoops! Dude, don't let the damn kid see. I know, right? Like, cover her eyes! Oh! Renju. And his left eye's gouged out, too. Oh my gosh, why are they after Misaki's parents? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Day three, Sunday. Shokubai. Police headquarters, 9.17 a.m. You look awful. Have you been sleeping any? My best friend was murdered, boss. I don't have it in me to sleep right now. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Fishing flag? A flag with big catch on it. Um, let's talk about pewter first? Why are you here anyway? Am I not allowed to be here? No, I didn't mean it like that. I was And here I brought first. his damn kid to see it. I was it. just oh. talking to the boss about Renju's murder. You seem troubled, pewter. Two murders, one right after the other. How could I not be? Any thoughts on the culprit? Renju Don't show me that face, removed. please! Right. Shoko, too. So perhaps, Mr. Date, you are the killer. You're missing your left eye, so you steal them from others. Then I would replace my eyeball. Only a joke. I'm too tired for your jokes right now, Pewter. Hmm. Actually, you lost your eye six years ago, correct? It could be the same person that came yes, after me. Yes, but I don't remember anything from back then. I lost my eye and my memories. Well, someone should sink into your to head! I saw you a year later. We have been together for more than five years. Um, uh, wait, anything else Pewter can say? Peter looks surprisingly serious. Boss! Uh... What happens to Misaki? She's sleeping at the hospital. They're going to give her counseling after she wakes up. I see. Her mother and her father. I hope she'll be okay. She had to see both their bodies. Oh my gosh, she's only 12! About Nenju. You were the first on the scene, so you know this better than anyone, but Renju was murdered. You don't say! No way this was a suicide. And this the fact that his left eye was removed tells me that this was the same killer as Shoko. The serial killer. The new Cyclops killer. What? That's suicide. the nickname no. that's been spreading around headquarters. Like, you don't say! You. Yes. Several years ago. Pewter. <sighs> there is no point in hiding it from him. He would find out on his own eventually. Yes, tell me all the info. It's all over the news. These murders have gone viral, so to speak. The killings from six years ago have continued. The Cyclops killer is back. 
Six but I didn't die. Ago. Death is not dead. Is that what you were talking about, boss? Like, Shoko and Renju are dead. Fine. And they lost their left eyes too. But Data to lost his left eye and he's still alive. Um, how about you getting any sleep? Of before I not. talk to the before I talk about the more serious the thing. Up, answering to the higher ups, the press. I'm just taking a little breather. About the incident six years ago. We have a name for it down at HQ. The original Cyclops serial killings. To distinguish it from this new one. It was six years ago in October. Four bodies were found in the mountains of Akikawa Valley. But the decomposition of the corpses were all at different stages. They were each killed sometime during May to September of that year. But they did have two things in common. They were all young women. And... Each corpse was missing their right eyeball. Pulled right. out posthumously. But this time it's the left. Cyclops. A few days after the corpses were discovered, the killer sent a statement to the press. I killed them, and they are now my dear companions. Something like that. He signed the statement under the name Cyclops. Hence the name, the Cyclops Killer. The Cyclops is a mythological race of one-eyed giants. That is the killer. A version of him from a different him, timeline is killing the all, all the people. Of Uranus, god of the sky, and hmm. Gaia, goddess of Earth. Cyclops were known for their outstanding strength and smithing ability. We all know what a Cyclops so the is. To the press wasn't yeah, a he's an X man. Was the real killer? <laughs> yes, it had to be. A picture of one of the victims right after she was killed was sent along with the letter. Was the Cyclops captured? He was not. No, in six years we never got a single trace. So maybe Cyclops is responsible for these murders as well. No. But why would he come back impossible. now? Why? why do you keep saying that? For one, the original Cyclops killer only killed women. Renju doesn't fit that profile. Second, all of the victims had their right eyes removed. This but time it's Shoko their left. And Renju We're missing their left eye. It could be the Cyclops killer. Co like the timing of the eye removal is also inconsistent. Oh. Also inconsistent. Oh, because the original Cyclops killer removed yeah. the eyes after the victims were killed. This time they're doing it before. But Shoko and Renju were both still alive. Oh, that's gnarly. But even so, you can't say for sure this isn't our guy. Maybe they're just doing things a little differently now. Or do you have another reason? I'm sorry, Date. I can't say anymore. They know something. Bullshit, you can't. It's a national secret. How can it be a national secret? Date, please forget about it. No! I told you already, you don't need to know anything about that case to investigate this one. The criminal for this case and the case six years ago are not the same. Iva, bring up all investigation records of the original Cyclops serial killings. I already had a look through the database while you were talking. Unfortunately, I found no relevant information. What? I also did not discover anything of note on the internet. Only amateur theories. All lacking credibility and evidence. Mm. Damn it. So how do you like this compared to 999? Um... I think I prefer 999 better so far because 999 really threw you into a situation where you're like, shoot, we have to get out. And you, like, I feel like there are more puzzles that came a lot sooner. This one, it's like a little bit more slow paced, like, ooh, like this seems normal, but how's it gonna get weird and freaky? Because even in Zero Time Dilemma and Virtue's Last Reward, you were just like, boom, here it is, solve this puzzle, get out. Here it's more like story driven instead of like, hey, you need to get out and solve these puzzles. That's all we have for now. All right. Special Agent Date, we need you to continue your work. Right. I think I'll head back to where Renju was found, Sunfish Pocket. Date, you're exhausted. Why don't you get some sleep before you continue your investigation? I'm fine. Let's go, Iva. Understood. 
Um, another thing I like more about the Nanari game series is, like, the puzzles. Because it's a room escape, like, you have to solve actual puzzles. Like, hey, unlock this code, figure out where these things go, arrange this thing to make it unlock, blah blah blah. And this one, the more interactive parts, is just like, oh hey, just choose this or this. It's like, choose your own adventure and maybe you got it right, maybe you got it wrong. Like, I want actual puzzles to solve, like a room escape. Um, I feel like the characters aren't as interesting either. Yeah, like the cast of characters in here, they're like kind of quirky, like Iris and Ota. But they they feel like um, tropes. Um, let's see. In the Nonary games, it's just like, whoa, you seem like one way, but you're actually another. They were more archetypes instead of stereotype, tr instead of being tropey. Um, you should play Danganronpa, or as you call it, Dangobango. <laughs> maybe, maybe I will give that a chance. I always thought that uh, Dangobango was kind of scary, and I didn't want to do it. But if it's about the same level as the Nanari games and this kind of like gore, then I think I'll pick it up. Also, there was a sense of urgency in the other games, and your decisions felt heavier. Yes, it did. This one, it's just like, oh, hey, you have 360 seconds, but you get to use timies and retries. I'm like, that's not really... Hmm. But we'll see. The kill scenes aren't as graphic as this game. Okay, then I can definitely pick up Dango Bongo. Let's go to Sunfish Pocket. Oh, Miso in the back. Dante, the vehicle is accelerating 2% slower than usual. I'm tired. Did you put anything in the trunk? No. What about the back seat? Misuki's there. Back seat? Mizuki! Mizuki! Hey, watch out! Ice forward, stupid! Musiki climbed up to the front and sat in the passenger seat. Uh, how did you even get in here? It wasn't locked. I just opened the door. I've been here for like ten minutes. Why don't your doors have auto locks? I know you like old cars, but you gotta lock the doors. You should be a little more apologetic for someone who just got caught breaking into my car. Mizuki does raise a valid point. If you are not more serious about security, at least she put on her seatbelt. You should consider replacing the car altogether. You too. Uh, what are you doing here? I ditched the hospital. They're probably freaking out over there right now. I'm taking you back. No, don't. Nothing will change if I stay at the hospital all day. You're going to investigate, right? Take me with you. I can help. How is a little runt like you going to be any help? I'm Renju's daughter. Maybe I'll notice something you don't. Something only his daughter would know. But you barely know. spoke with your dad. My daddy was killed. I can't just stay at the hospital. <sighs> Fine. Don't say I never did anything for you. You're going to take me along? Just promise not to interfere with the investigation. Got it. Uh, let's keep talking. How are you doing? Well, I can still talk this time. Maybe I'm just getting used to it. Mizuki's psychological wounds have been healed by the sink. Uh... Nice weather we're having. <laughs> if you have nothing to talk about, you don't have to say anything. Fair enough. You're an adult, shouldn't you know that already? If you start talking about the weather, it means you have nothing to say. Damn. What a brat. Vicious. Uh, do you want to catch the suspect? No, it's more like I don't like sitting still and moping all day. I've grown out of my brooding, pretentious teenager phase. You're not I'm a teen yet. Preteen to say. Are you not aware of Mizuki's mental prowess? 
She is far more developed than her classmates. She is even reading psychology papers by Alfred Adler. That means nothing. Sounds pretentious to me. Uh, about Renju. Hey, about Renju. Do you have anything to tell me? Anything at all that might help? Well, it's not about Daddy, but I heard from Daddy uh, that Mom had a secret. Shoko we're playing Donkey Konga. <laughs> no, we're playing Dango Bango. Um, I'm ahead to sleep. Night, homie. Okay, good night, Web. Thanks for joining. Have a good night. That sounds like I have a very smart kind of thing to say. <laughs> What's Shoko's secret? Did you know that Mom was the representative of an investment company? Yeah, I did. That whole company was a big scam. A scam? Well, I don't know the details. They start up a company to get people to invest in it, but then shut it down on purpose and keep the money. She got really rich like that. Oh my gosh. Shoko did this? Yep. By herself? No, dummy. Of course it was with other people. I saw gangsters there sometimes. If she ever got into trouble, she had them take care of it. I am scanning Ooh. all known crime databases, but I cannot find any reports referencing this. They must have been extraordinarily careful. Uh, anyway, I'm glad that you're okay. I'm not okay. So, you want to go back to the hospital? I'd be more than happy to drop you off. That's not what I meant. Why are you always so pushy, Dante? I'm not pushy, I'm just worried. You've got a weird way of showing it. Doesn't look like you're worried. You're just weird. You've always got something smart to say, huh? You're just like Renju. Dante. Oof. What about Daddy? Nothing. You have no tact, do you? This is why you're single and always will be. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> That's where you're wrong, kiddo. I look like a single father when you're around. Chicks love it. Ah, uh, yeah, creepy. Kids love to see creepy old men hanging out with a sixth grader. Hey, what are you implying? Ooh, did I make you mad? Now I'm stuck in a car with an angry old creepy pervert. <laughs> I'm not an old creepy pervert. And even if you were my age, you're not my type. Ew, I don't want to know about your type. Hey, you started it. Stupid old man. Not Best that kid. old. <laughs> Oh, I missed the dialogue option again. Damn it. Oh, hey, Master, how you doing? Thanks for joining. Did you change your medication? No, I did not. Oh, shoot, I've been streaming for two hours now. Akiba, sunfish pocket. Music and I walked back into sunfish pocket. Oh, uh, Detective Date. Good to see you, sir. And this is... Have you looked through the case file yet? Oh, no, oh, I am so sorry. She's the victim's. Yes, please let us through. Oh, there's cute jellyfish hanging on the ceiling. Ooh, there's tridents on the walls. That's so awesome. That's where he was hung. Okay, um... What would happen if you drank the whole med bottle? Um, I'd overdose and die. <laughs> Probably. Okay, um, I'm gonna end stream here. I will continue this tomorrow. This seems like a good place to stop. Um, save. Yeah. I've been getting so used to, um, I kind of want to save over a new file. I'm kind of getting used to streaming like three, four hour sessions now, but it's making me so tired and drained and like, I have a headache. I've had a headache like the whole day today, so I think I should sign off earlier. Give med so I may die. No! Don't die yet. You're too young. Okay, yeah, but anyways. This is a good place to stop and I will pick up the story again tomorrow. Um... And then I think next week my stream schedule is also going to be Monday, Wednesday, Thursday. Monday I'll be doing Tales of Zillia. Wednesday, Thursday I'll be doing AI Somnium Files because I think I'm going to finish this way earlier than I could finish Zillia. That way I can also start Raido Kuzunoha earlier. Uh, anyways, thanks for joining. I'll see y'all next time. Stay toasty. Have a good night, everyone.
Bye bye.